Hi. Ah, you must be the people for the visit. Come on in. Welcome to Engineering Services. My name's Steve Mason and I'm the Service Manager. Today we're going to give you a quick tour of some of our laboratories and some of the work we do there. We have three locations on the John Dalton site in the middle of Manchester and these cover a wide range of subject areas from manufacturing uh, through to mechanical, electrical, electronic engineering, uh, product design and also media technology. The kind of services we offer in the laboratories are pretty much what you'd expect from any laboratory service. We set up and we run laboratory exercises. Uh, we assist and advise students throughout their student projects. We also help staff uh, to support research and to develop laboratories, build laboratory rigs. Our responsibilities as technicians, really the, the three key things are one, to look after the health and safety of all staff, visitors and students while they're in the workshops and the laboratories, but also to make sure that students get the very best possible experience they can while they're at MMU and they enjoy themselves but also to make sure that the university itself gets best value from all the resources that we control. That's a brief kind of overview of what we do. I'll now take you through to the first laboratory, which is electronic engineering, and Paul Lingard will show you around. This is our recently refurbished John Dalton Tower open plan laboratory area, which provides practical based learning support for approximately 120 undergraduate and postgraduate students. Apparatus allows students safely to work with and learn about the principles, characteristics and operation of high voltage, single and three phase power control devices and multi-control circuits. Computer based Virtual instrumentation is rapidly replacing the older box electrical measurement instruments. Temporary rapid prototyping machinery replaces crude, hand drawn, acid etched printed circuit boards. Modern manufacturing techniques gives the undergraduate the capability to learn about and design complex electronic circuits like this microprocessor controlled main solving robot. We also teach the programming of electrical and electro-mechanical devices. Here we have last year's Formula Student car being tested from a dynamometer. Formula Student is a worldwide competition for university students. Here is the chassis for this year's Formula Student car, designed and built by the students and manufactured by the technical staff. Components are manufactured from CNC machines. And here is a completed product. In 
the thermodynamics laboratory, which holds more than 30 experiments and has specialised equipment for final year projects such as dual fuel research engine, wind tunnel as well as water and pipe rigs and this smoke tunnel. Large scale laser scanning using CFD, computer fluid dynamics, creates a complete 3D view of this car. In the product engineering laboratory, we have laser arms that also create 3D views and a coordinate measuring machine here collecting data from false teeth made in our rocket prototype equipment. In our new media studio, with its high definition and state-of-art technology, we have the best equipment to support our students. Here are two examples of our third stream income generation. Status carries out safety tests on vehicle seat belts and bodies. to you carry out research and consultancy for the railway industry. RTU specialise in train suspension dynamics and track design technology. Engineering Services supports lots of different customers, including academics and local businesses. But our most important service is supporting our students. It's not as long as